Okay, good evening, everyone. And how are we all tonight? Thank you for the 25 bits and the host, Ward Misfits. Much appreciated. And uh, yeah, it's nice when the stream starts first time with the quality options and OBS behaves itself and you can just start playing the video games. Ah, if only life was so simple as to allow it on a consistent basis. So, I am uh, continuing the playtest session from last night. Uh, I did get most of it done, to be fair, but um, there is, well, one, maybe two, depending on time constraints, uh, pieces of business to take care of, although mainly just this one, really. So it might be a little shorter tonight, but we'll see how it goes. I mean, if I have a bit of extra time, maybe I'll, uh, I'll search for another one, but I do have a backup sort of play test thing in mind and maybe someone else will fill the gap if need be so hello the vh productions it has been a while indeed uh, good to see you hope you are doing well and let us begin shall we with the first word of the night probably maybe the only one we'll have to see how it goes so this was something that was uh, requested of me um, on doom world I uh, just need to actually double check if I have the original message bear with me for a moment I think I do oh no I don't sorry where the hell did this come from Oh no, of course, this was requested in a private message on Twitch um, by uh, Infernal Monsoon. Um, hopefully they'll show up again and they can talk about this project. You're working on a big boy ward. Don't know if it'll be done in time for a playtesting session. Oh, that's cool. Well, if it's not ready, I mean, I do these at least once a month, so it can always be done in April or whatever. So, don't feel you have to rush it just to try and get it out for tonight. You know, I'd rather you take your time and get it done in an organized and uh, proper manner, you know. So, this is uh, called A Piece of Hell. A community project I should have uploaded sooner. Uh, this was posted on January the 8th. Hi everyone, just wanted to get some info out of the way first, even though I'm very new to Doom World, I've been making maps in private ever since 2012, or I only ever uploaded two maps in the past that are likely lost in the ether nowadays. Not too fussed though, since they were awful anyways. However, around mid-2020, I got them back into mapping after years of not making anything, after coming up with an idea for a community map project for a YouTuber known as Piece of Pie Software. Hey Primevus, doot doot to you too. A good friend of mine and one of the first other Let's players on YouTube it just so happens to be a huge Doom nut. I wanted to get back into mapping by doing something cool for him, but in what community we have for being cool dudes and dudettes, so do check him out. I'm sure you've noticed how cleverly we named the Ward. No, I've not, I think I've heard that name once. After partaking in MFG 38's 3x3 community project, oh hey, someone I've played recently, it inspired me to sign up here and finally be in touch with the Doom community at large as I do see myself making and putting more maps out there in the foreseeable future since I also mind how fun making stuff is and wanting to share this budget from 2020 with more people. I thought I was about to want first because there's no commas. Need more commas. Yay, more Doom. Now, onto the good stuff. A Piece of Hell was a, a month-long deal where me, MFG38, and D Craven one managed to make five maps. While others were invited, us three were the only ones who managed to make anything for the project and pulled out all the stops to make the best dang maps we could. While I was the lead, I felt obligated to put out more maps and write the story in the intermission screens. MFG did an excellent job compiling the forward and making those intermissions work, and Craven made an awesome boss, as well as a hilarious little Easter egg of a silly little in joke we have. The story in general is full of in jokes, really. 
The antagonist's name is also a very old in-joke. I promise this was made before The Ancient Gods Part 1. Hey, serious khaki demon. How you doing? He's the one behind... Oh, for fuck's sake, behind doing Doom 64 Absolution because he was so weird with the arse. Okay. Well, it's very casual, friendly, and hang out too rough and hurt me plenty. It is quite the challenge in ultraviolence with a decent length, roughly two hours for a first run, considering the small number of maps. The maps I have made have full DM co-op support, as well as bleak were never taste tasted. Tasted? I assume you mean tested. As the word seemingly doesn't work in Zandoran, but may work fine by other means. I expect UV co-op to be crushingly brutal for most players, however, so do let me know if anyone can get that working. We'd love to hear your experiences. Edit. They do map set in hex and format, but I strongly advise you use GZ Doom to play. Crouch and jump have been disabled. Alright. Hey there, MFG38. From a request of yours to a project you were directly involved in. Oh, that's it. It's just a Zadu map in hexen format, and there are custom enemies as well, apparently. So that's a thing. Cool. Hey, Turner K, you can see you as well. Uh, I'll go MBF, I guess. I don't think we have a hexen strict format. Uh, I know that hexen is. I don't think it's boom, is it? I think hex and... I'll go MBF format. Oh, default should do. All right, then. Default it is. But we always have to tag the visible players. I mean... Oh, I don't know why that's not a default, to be honest, but whatever. How are you doing, Alper? Sorry if I'm a little tired. I did go for a lengthy walk earlier after work, so I might be yawning a bit. Um, right, so. Hexen generally suggests no infinite height stuff. Texas doesn't have those. Well, default doesn't have infinite height. Sure, we should be okay. So that's, that's a thing. Right, let's begin, shall we? Oh crap, we have mouse walk enabled. Because of the previous thing. Let's fix that. Right away, here we go. Dark Attack by Infernal Monsoon. So they're off. Yeah, yeah, I mean, even my one has no jump and no crouch. It turns out if you know the, the code, it's not that difficult to implement. I used to think there was like some fancy magic or something. Oh well. What is with that midi pitch? Going throughout we was trying to release your Hexen Hub. Do people like your Hexen Hub? Uh did I just see a unpegged door thing? I think I did. Sounds just like the uh, as it should. It's a fluid synth default for Doom. I'm not an audio expert by any means, but uh, I don't know it's anything particularly different. Now we'll see, it's like... You should use this opportunity to work on your projects, Alpha. There's too many mappers these days that have projects and projects and projects and projects to do.
That would be my advice, to be completely honest. Don't get bogged down in project creep. Start finishing projects. I know it's a trapping of some do mappers to start projects and then do other projects and then do other projects. And before you know it, they have all the projects to do. And all the deadlines and then they're stressed. And then come the Twitter meltdowns. Or the Doom World meltdowns, I guess, in this case. Kiss. Etc. Hey Shavni, how's it going? I can't aim very well. I wonder if this is designed for pistol start or continuous, by the way. Since you're one of the three people who worked on this MFG, is this pistol start or continuously designed? Okay, is that going to be timed? No. Nice couch. You want to show up, man? Okay. It's fine, buddy. One hard against you. The big sector couch. With a stack of papers there. For some serious gazing out the window. Action. And not much else, apparently, because, I mean, I I do see a TV up there, but this is, like, a very weird room if that is the TV placement. Who am I to judge? Brad Sue. Hmm. Where'd you come from? Oh, so they are bounce for pistol starts then. I see. Candles! I wish I had the focus to work on a single project, but no, gotta be at least two. Do projects on top of professional indie projects. Yeah. You all. Never mind, I thought I saw something weird there. Not the case. So I can't wait for these wacky in-jokes that I won't understand. Oh, this is where the rad suit would have come in handy. Maybe I should go back and get it? Yes, let's just waste everyone else's time and get, get the rad suit. Ugh. Probably still worth it, my dude. It means saving a few pain ticks worth of damage, anyway. Five bout. Technically, map five is almost bout of pistol, so I'll save for a spider mastermind I swapped out after the firewing. Oh, God. I am completely safe from all things. Uh, uh, no, 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 no. Yes. Spit your acid or whatever. 13 secrets? That's a lot of secrets, man. Have fun out there, guys. You want one map for the maximum budget. Get looking, sweet! Oh, more rad suits. Uh, 
Oh boy. So this great quad has a slip gate like quake. Projects to do, but they're all game requests, not exciting things like Doom Wars or something. Just game requests. Did I receive 50 bucks in bits as a direct donation yesterday? Yes. Yes, I did. That's the donation. Don't worry, it's not happened again. Yeah, this happened. Uh, yesterday, at some point. Um, yeah, on Streamlabs, you can replay uh, messages. That's all I did there. But yeah, I was donated uh, $50 in bits yesterday for some reason. No, 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 I didn't get another one. I was just replaying it. as proof, if you will. Alright, what the hell did I unlock? Well, the rest of them, I guess. Right? A <laughs> sweet zone. Sure. I told you about in confidence, MFG. You weren't supposed to tell anyone about that. Can't really be a surprise now, can it? Ooh, that bell. That bell deserves to be blown up. Still. So, quite a lengthy rad maze later. Okay. Ah, what was that? That's the last one in the way of... Nope. Still not over yet. The, uh, the way through the maze continues. Bustly. Ah, now we're on the other side, though. Ain't got something to do with it. Maybe. Okay, then. 
sure. Right, is that finally open the fucking door? Yep. Does. Probably getting murdered by a bunch of others right now. Boy. Ow, 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 fucking hell. Please, someone attack that chain gunner and take him out. Oh, what a god. No, don't need you doing that. Causing him to free for everyone. Ow! Where the fuck are all these? No, oh, screw that. I'm taking the health now. Gonna need it. How many, uh, unexpected? Well, expected, but, un but unwelcome angles, I should say. Here. Yeah. Right, that was probably one of the biggest uh, cheers I've ever received in terms of its quantity, at least. Guess it's kind of neat that people can donate anonymously, I suppose. Never know who it was. It will forever remain a mystery. Walking outside area, this. I doubt it was Draugen. Draugen has paid me. Draugen has donated in games over the years. So I don't think it was Draugen. Mega Lego Smuggler? Nah, I think I'd be out of character for them. Besides, if you want to donate $50 to me, why would he not then announce his presence in the chat afterwards? I don't know. Oh, big boy. I've not heard a single peep out of Mega Lego Smuggler for about two weeks. Oh well, first level is done. I'm not hearing it, Vlad Gay. Sorry. Really not hearing it. So, not a bad first level. Uh. I don't know if that rad suit maze of sorts felt a bit uninspired, maybe. Honestly. I didn't feel particularly inspired by the rad suit maze, but it wasn't terrible by any means. I, I think I saw an unpegged door here or there, and the texturing was a bit flat to begin with, but not a bad map overall. You know, definitely not. Oh, as you blasted your way through each hellish monstrosity that impeded your progress to the teleporter, you know this isn't just any ordinary genomic invasion. There's an intelligence to this chaos, 
a guiding force leading them to our destruction in their eternal crusade for a damned humanity. Clearly this is the work of some grand archdemon or an unknowable entity of unfathomable power. How else would they be able to annihilate the highly trained security force defending this base? The only way to stop this is to strike the demons in the heart by going into hell itself. However, upon going through the tower portal, you find yourself in another familiar UAC base, Installation 66, a cargo transfer and storage station utilizing teleportation technology. Surely this place is your ticket into the demon's domain. Hello, D. Craven. It was a remake of a snap map. That explain a lot. So this is another map by Infernal Monsoon. Okay, cool, now we have two out of three of the mappers in the chat. Just need Infernal Monsoon for the hat trick. It was in the game you had to finish. Were you playing one of those dirty MOBAs? Or FPS games, or PvP type of those? Thing on hold! Whoa! You were playing League of Legends? Yeah, that's fine, you can play League of Legends. Fucking... I thought I already did, Black Guy. I have to be honest with you, I was thinking of returning to WoW, but then I saw one Steamroll game and I thought, yeah, I think I'll pass. Forever. There's, there's kind of a reason why I don't go back to competitive games. Well, I don't know, I've played a few of your wads, I think, haven't I? Yow! Ow, ow, ow. Get the hit scans away. No way. No! I missed an opportunity to get some extra health potions. Piss. Oh well, whatever. Oh good. Oh. Well, I'll see you first time, white guy. I mean, I got another one I've got lined up after this if I do finish this with enough time left. Which is also probably fairly lengthy. So, we'll see how things develop. Uh, I'm playing on Ultraviolet, Steve Raven. MFG suggested the Ultra that continue. Pistol starts were balanced for the map, so pistol start it is. Yeah. I mean Don't get me wrong, I I feel like League of Legends has got better somewhat in terms of the gameplay since like a, a decade ago. My problem is that for a game like that, I would be a terribly toxic individual in playing it. I'm not one of these people that could switch off from being competitive and caring about that kind of thing, you know. I'm not one of these chill people. So... Yeah, I mean, I take competitive games very seriously. I 
I mean, you see how I handle single player games. Just imagine that for that book to, well, Moe player. I am chill until I am not. Come on, Hell Knight. No, Hell Knight. Good Hell Knight. And yet, whatever. Hey, Yugi boy. This is um, a piece of hell. A small community project. Well, if you're an ultra violence, I apologize in advance. Okay. I will call you horrible mean words in advance. Now, see, now neither of us has to apologize for any rudeness later on. We just sort of embraced it. Boy, my ammo is well. What kind of is, really? Gotta be careful on ammo, if possible. Up we go, please. Right in my face. Ah. Right in my face. Ah. Hey. Go out. Okay, no, 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 no. Also, no. you out. Yeah. Come on, him. Him. Good boy. Come on, him. Come on, him. Come on. Rip. 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 Ah, oh, crap. More of them. Oh, wow, he killed it in one shot. Oh, that's no good. What is that? Oh, he's there. Come on. Dude. Inspector there? Barely see the bastard. Oh god, my health is very, very low. So, oh god, there's a baron. No, 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 no. No. Just. No. All of my no. Elf woe, time to save. Yep. I can do this. I have confidence in my abilities. 
not completely botch this. I don't know what those two switches. Ah, there we go. There we go. Oh god. Whoa! Yeah, hey! No, you keep yeah. You are gonna be a nuisance. Okay. Left. Left. Ah! Screw you. Okay, hit scans. Don't want to see hit scans. Really don't want to see hit scans. Really don't want to see hit scans. At all. Not going in there then. We need to be back to earlier in the level. Really need that extra health or something. Up we go! Go up! Go up, you... Yeah. yeah, go up. Let's backpedal a little bit. I need some health really badly. I have to go into it. I have to go into a hit scan area, and I need something. Oh, you got to be kidding me. There's nothing on offer here. Absolutely nothing. I have a stim pack. Nine secrets. Inbound spear? No, I did not use the inbound spear. I didn't know there was one. Well, it looks like we're going to have to engage the, uh, that area with minimal health. Very, very carefully. You have two more HP than you really need. Oh, it's one of those fucking doors. The ones that won't open close on a snap command. I hate those kind of doors. They kind of take forever to open. No, you don't. Come on, go down. Uh, oh. All right. Hey, health. Yummy health. Hey. Oh wow. Look at that. We got some uh, arcade sticks. It's Doom Cube time! The you snapping is kind of wonky, it makes punches feel dangerous if they're white. Oh, cool. A secret shove up. Awesome. Well, well, that's useful. I'm still not killing you, though. You'd just be a waste. <laughs> You're the one who got the keys. Yeah, now we can continue. And SSG for the trouble too. Even better. Uh, right. 
But, uh... What was that supposed to accomplish? Yeah, Storage elevator, what happens here? <laughs> hey, bemused. A bomb again. stuff up here. What a mean, mean stuff. You know? to your stream while I'm mapping. Yeah, quite a few people do that. They do that with other Doom streams too. If I was mapping by myself, I would probably do exactly the same thing. Nothing like watching someone play Doom while you map for it, right? And then we have to deal with uh, Pinky's just to get one shot at this. The real target I wanted. Yeah, I guess that worked out okay. Cool. Oh, no problem, Yugi boy. Tis me pleasure. But wait, there's another area I haven't been able to explore. Oh, it's a secret. No, it's not why. Well, this is the exit. I will SSG dump on this ballad. Take that. Yeah. There we go. All right. Ah. Yeah. So this was an okay map too. Ugh. Shh. 
Shut up, Sirius. It's not coming back. All right, then, Alper. Thanks for tuning in. I will see you later. Easy fix. Don't use Revenant. An excellent suggestion. The only issue is when you test your mind, I don't have to Revenant. Yeah, I'm pretty much three. Oh, man. The confusion. Yeah, so, also fun. Oh, we get these for each level, are we? Okay. This whole base was also infested with the dynamic presence. Even more powerful than the previous one, and yet no pathway to be found. The only option is to leave this place and look for the source of the invasion elsewhere. You scour the surrounding land for hours, occasionally fending off small pockets of lesser fiends, but nothing substantial. You find yourself going weary and tired, as if the pressure of a demented presence rides upon your shoulders. You find it hard to form a single thought as a volp energy envelops your body, causing immense pain as you drop to the ground with gritted teeth. You feel your hands and knees soaked in warm water as you drift across a gentle ocean standing on the surface of the waves. A barrier that separates you and the endless void beneath you. You look up to see a craggy structure jutting unnaturally in the middle of the azure expanse and its inhabitants await your arrival with hungry eyes. It's about time they deserted, deserved quite the beating. <laughs> so this is D. Craven 1's map. Okay then. Substantially tougher affair. To the point where I think I'll just, uh... Need some assistance in dealing with those revenants, shall we say? Get out of the fucking way, fucking imps. Uh. Go away. 
Go away. I'm trying to get some infighting to go down. Christ. You're not helping, guys. Nope. Almost. Whoa. Hey, 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 hey! Go away! Fair enough, would you? Hey, Terminator! Bengal! Just use the lift. I suppose. I just want them to be distracted. I don't care if they don't kill each other. I just want them to not be. I just want to turn them in for. Are they trying to fight different ones? Oh, cool. They're both distracted. Oh, that's worked out perfectly for me then. That's them dealt with for a while. I can... How are you doing? Anyway. Right. You... Must... Go. No, thank you. No, thank you. Thank you. No more heads. Oh god, no angry cyber demon. No. Do not want angry cyber demon. No. Shit. What the fuck is he doing getting any angle on that? Jesus, dude. I'm gonna grab 10 health. Holy fuck. Killed both of them. Well, still less hell now it's for me to deal with, I guess. The lift is the West School way. Don't mind the farts, it's part of the experience. Does Nevano stay in my stream sometimes? Teleports around, I see. Oh, hey. Secret, I think. Maybe a secret? Maybe not a secret. There's a fort! What? What are you. Is this your idea? What the? It's a duck! Or a swan. Whack, whack. Oh, it's a smelly goose. Or a swan. One of those. I still don't have a door to go through. Hey, Mr. Woose. Kill it. I 
Yeah, you can't actually attack it. So there's that. Um. Oh, he's teleported again. Good riddance. Uh, I have to be honest with you, Bengal Tiger. I think in my entire history of my channel, I don't think Nevanos has ever joined my chat. And, um, I'd rather not talk about Nevanos, if that's okay with you. Let's just say that he bought, yeah, he, uh, he also, there's the whole fact that he blocked me on Twitter and Twitch and doesn't want to talk to me anymore. For reasons undefined. Reasons undefined. Reasons undefined. There's also that. Yeah, I mean, in all seriousness, I don't think he's ever joined my chat, really. But that doesn't really matter. I am seemingly stuck. What the fuck have I missed? I don't think I have enough plasma to kill him. Yeah, we, we, I don't really want to talk about it. We don't know why it happened. We're moving forward. You know, if he doesn't want to, if he wants to block me and not give a reason, that's his business. So be it. So, uh, yeah. So, you can use the switch on the pillar to access the elevator. Oh, yay, an arch vial! Oh, yay, a cyber demon! Don't stop following me around the fucking level! Can you please just go over to the teleport on this side so I can not deal with you? Ugh. It's you too. Okay, well. Hey! Cut that out. Right now. Yeah. Appearances can be deceiving. Let's put it, let's just leave it at that. But anyway. This cyber's not going to go away, is he? Now we must deal with... Oh, for fuck's sake! I should just use the BFG to kill him, to be honest. Save myself a lot of time. Why do we have to have revenant snipers in this fucking level? Good God. It's the one thing I just don't want to deal with, revenant snipers. No, thank you. Oh. Oh look, I can snipe too! Never interrupt me please, thank you. Now, snipe that you bastards! You know, if you're gonna do that, why don't you fight these revs for me instead and not be useless? Alright, oh, can't fight them. Use the goal. Fine, Cyber Demon, please go all the way over here so I can use you to fight two revs. I'll wait.
But I can use him to get my I might ah here we go. There Let's use the enemy of our enemy to distract and kill the other enemy. Come on! Fire your shitty homing projectile. No, fire another oh for God's sake, now he's out of range. No, now you need to come over here to get back into range again. No, don't wander around over there for five years. Oh, for crying out loud. Just get over here. Right, there. Now, Revan, if you kindly. No, Cyber, come on. Cyber, for sake, why is the Cyber being so goddamn uncooperative? Move over here! Jesus! I just want you to fire one rev for me. No, I'll just boom around over here all freaking day! Right, now I have time to wind up my BFG shot. Clear off. Don't need you. Really do not need you, sir. No thanks. Alright, up we go. Oh. Oh, why did I do that? Come on. Yes. Yeah. No, you motherfucker. God damn it. Oh, God's sake, man. God damn it. No, no, no. Okay, go! No, fuck that noise. Can I? Can I? Even... Get up there? Ugh. Friggin' hell. Oh, he's so close. He's so close, but he keeps wandering off in the wrong direction. At the wrong time. Oh no, I'm a cyber demon that can't help but wander around all over the place. No, too late for that now. Yes, thank you. Now you fucking do it. Yeah, clown. Oh, there we go. Hey, Cyber Demon. Why don't you learn how to stay in one fucking spot for five minutes and not move around like a patrolling joke in the box? Nice to see you discovered how to infight the Revenant, finally. Asshole. He's moving around. There it is. Anyway, I wish I wish Nevanos the best of luck at getting his sunless max record thing. Hopefully he achieves that. So 
sorry, I'm just catching up with the chat slightly. Hey, Infernal Monsoon, how's it going? Do we have to go through this? Sound we do. safe. Ah, oh, can't get back up there. Ugh. Ah, uh, whatever. I don't think there's anything up there. Painful part is over. Oh, that's a relief. That was a swan, yes. It's part of the in jokes of this ward, apparently. I guess one of them likes farting swans. I have no idea. Link if you're curious as to what this is. There are lots of jokes that nobody but you three will get. And is that the what you just hope looking for reactions of everyone else this way? What will they think of our farting swan joke, eh? We'll have to see. Me swan. A swan that farts rainbows with a purple rocket. Oh right. Refer to that secret now. Yeah. Okay then. Really, really don't like it. Ow. No, 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 no. Oh boy. Oh, fuck off. 
Oh, he's got a really easy position as well. Oh, the big juke. I don't know if that counted. Boom. It did. Up oh, yours. Thanks for the 25 bits. If I'm coming. Yeah, don't, don't, don't worry about it, Bengal Tiger. There's nothing to to worry about. It's it's a recent event. I mean, to be clear, if I, I, I don't really... I'm not overly bothered. I just wish I knew the reason. That's all. It's the only thing that will bug me a little bit. You know, just give me a fucking reason. You know, what I did wrong. But, whatever. That's in the past. We move forward. You know, I've had a busy month and a half, really, with things happening. It's taught me a few things, mind you. So it's not an old bad. Secret, I suppose. Was there any point to that? Maybe I've maybe I've activated something back a little bit. Oh yes. Oh yes. There we go. save my ammo. second one. Thank God for that. 
Wow, okay, never mind. Yes, there is a second one. Not anymore, though. Now he's gone. No, you don't. No. No, you don't. You know, we'll fight each other now, if you'd like. Come on, fight each other. Do it! Fight, 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 fight! Get out of here. Nope. That shark gonna be there. I can deal with him, but I'm gonna need to deal with his little spectral friends first. There we go. Alright, almost there. Thing on the floor, mind you. I'm going to check the building first. Check the paint sector. No paint sector found. Wait, more health. Cool. Hooray! Die, Baron. Whips. Oh god! Hungry, stupid fish! Ow! No! Sweet. Oh, he's asleep. Don't fish go bad. Oh, it was adorable when he's asleep.
I died so hard, I killed myself twice, apparently. He takes 20% damage from traces. Yeah. He did. So, that was, um, Phoneus. Seemingly a, a bit of a step up there for map quality, I think. Even if it was a little bit of cryptic to progress at times with the, some of the platforming, but um, an interesting map. All right, only on ultra violence and nightmare difficulty. In demonology, Phoneus is a great Marquis of Hell and has 29 legions of demon under his rule. He teaches rhetoric and languages, gives men a good name, and makes them be loved by their friends and foes. Depicted as a giant sea monster. All thanks to an ACS script by yours truly. Alright then, Bengal, thank you for tuning in, and I will see you around. Please do not feel bad about the four. That is the reason why I don't really want to talk about it. There is no, as, as, as far as I am concerned, there is no bad blood between me and him, and I wish to keep it that way. You know, an explanation would be nice, but one is not forthcoming, so I'm just going to upset that it's not to be. You, you can't please everybody in life. There are some people you will annoy, whether by intent or by accident. No one is perfect. Hey, Foreshock, how you doing? Get the joke about the Sea Monster XD? Ah, it's a dope fish. I get it. After defeating the horrific refinic creature of immense power blocking your way to the source of the evil with its menacing toothy smile. You finally step into Gateway, only to be greeted by a blinding flash followed by immense force and extreme heat. The demon set a trap. The cowardly beast couldn't even beat you in a fur fight, but it worked and now you find yourself in an impasse as you stare death in the face when suddenly you pass out in the blink of an eye. You wake up in a place completely unknown to you, with neither Earth nor Hell, but unsure whether it exists within your very own universe. A completely undescribable place floating above the clouds of a dimly lit world. You look around to see a man sitting in a chair across the door room from you, clearly watching you as you try to get your bearings, his complexion and clothing pale and grey, almost purely devoid of colour, but he's strangely familiar, giving off a calming sensation, but unsure if he should be trusted. I see you have found yourself in quite the predicament, he said in an almost poncy voice, as he chuckles slightly at you. You aim your pistol at him in demand for answers. Now, now, let's not be too hasty, shall we? I'm flinching at the sight of your gun. I know exactly who you're looking for, and I know just how to get there. You owe your weapon, interested in hearing what he has to say. It's not other than the great, almighty, inconceivable Bob. An undying god who has lived through more births and deaths of the trillions of universes within the multiverse than even I could count. And I can take you to him. He snaps his fingers and a pole comprised of bright red and oil energy forms in a great flash of otherworldly energies. But not directly. His domain is protected by a power even I cannot penetrate. But this point in hell is the only direct link. This battle will be won for the ages and I'm sure a swayer such as yourself can get the job done. He walks off, leaving you to your quest for a brief moment. He turns around and says, I have my reasons to help you. I even left a few toys in there for you. He walks, he then walks off laughing. What a strange man. You ready or gun and steal yourself as you jump into the perilous portal. Unsure of the horrors at the side within. <sighs> that was a fucking novella. Thanks, Infernal. Hey, Power Wolf. Another legend. Yes, for shock. He did some. He's done a few things, you know. 
a few casual things. 624 monsters, what the hell is this? Oh my god, that's a lot of enemies. Okay, thanks to go back into the cover and regret ever coming up up. Ah, my health went down by a third just stepping out for a few moments. And now there are demons blocking me. We need to really die and stuff. Thanks for the follow. I just followed you. Also, door! And we got one map to go after this. We're going to see the dope fish. Oh man, what's happening here? What is that? Oh boy. This is a very, uh... But, whoa! I wanna get out. Thank you. I'm gonna be stuck here for a while, I think. Oh no, he's coming down into the hole! He's stuck in the hole! He can't get down the hole! What the? Hey! Oh, fuck that, I'm restart. Oh, wait. Damn it! I didn't realize I'd not made a quick save. Oh, that's not a problem. Regardless. You heard a four shot through another Doom Tuber Decino. Yeah, there we go. Well, that's fine. I didn't really lose that much progress. Hey, this time I won't lose so much health. If I get stuck in the hole again. Hey, this time I can stay topside. Some hit scan is still hitting me. Oh, there's the exit. No, 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 no. Yes, don't change on me, bro. Please, don't do that. Okay, I have a chance now. I have chain gun, I have... I hope what I've been fighting is already occurring here. Oh no, I've attracted more unwantable enemies. Oh god, no! No! Don't do that! It's a really bad idea. Ugh. Uh, duck in the hole. Get out of the hole. I feel safe here in this red rock hole. I don't feel safe anywhere else. That, ah, 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 ah. No, no, that's pretty bad. That was pretty bad. Right there. This map is 80% optional and 100% paid. And 5% reason to remember the name. Ah, oh, come on! Really? Yet. God. Coming down here. Aha. Aha. That was aha, as in aha. It sure is nice to not be disturbed by something down here in the watery pits of hell. Not aha. I need another enemy to appear behind me, and another one to appear behind me. That was aha. 
Peace and quiet. Not to be interrupted by smelly hellspawn. Thank you very much. No, 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 no. You cannot have. This is mine. You get your own. No, 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 oh, fucking hell. You need to get out of the lava now. You need to get out of the lava now. You need to get out of the lava now. You need to get out of the lava and it's fucking blocked by an enemy that I can fuck get past immediately. Oh, nice duck. Shit. No. 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 No, no. 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 No, you can't. No. No. Oh, God. Just... Look out, pay the rent. Alright, just leave me alone. God damn, there's so many fucking enemies here. So many beefy fuckers. That, hey! Thank you. Alright then, see you later, Terminal. Obvious, enjoy this obviously very silly. Well, that's fine. I didn't want to. I didn't want all my weapons anyway, D Cravens. It's not a problem. I can. I can handle this. I can handle this. This is. This only take me in the next hour. This is fine. It's fine when the boss soul is taking. What the f I am playing on default compat, right? Oi. Okay, I think we've actually cleared enough of this area to sell real estate. I swear to god, you better not be coming from a pain or something. I swear to god. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, no, no. Not cool. Not cool. Putting an enemy at the top of a fucking staircase like that? That is absolutely no. No, that 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 is genuinely bad game design right there. You do not put enemies at the top of steep staircases like that. You made this for mouse work. Well, you should state so then. And even then, I'd tell you not to do that anyway. Fucking mouse work. So now it's time to bust out mouse work, is it? Fine. I'll mouse work. Whoa, it's so tall. Now this sucks a lot less, but still. Ah! Wait, why are they so slow? What's it like, really? What the hell? It's a turret? Alright, whatever, man. I'm gonna check the thread. Let's see. Blah 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 blah. Uh, mouse work, mouse work, mouse work, mouse work. 
doesn't say anything about mouse look anywhere here. Just says crouch jump disabled, use GZ Doom. Oh, it says mouse hook is allowed. Wowed is not the same as recommended, however. Oh god, more custom stuff. Uh, oh wait, I don't actually have a reason to come back up here. But I'm going to kill you anyway, because reasons. I don't think we want to step on that red thing again. No, god damn it! Don't fucking fly over there, you... Okay. He is gone. Good. Oh, goodness. I wanted to save some damn ammo by not doing that and not getting hit by a fucking projectile. The, comp the angles are timed itself really weirdly. No, thank you. I just want to grab the ammo, actually, and weave. There we go. Oh, cool. That's meant to be the... The, the whatever. That. Alright. So, no. Oh, Jesus Christ. Why is the auto aim just not. Just hit the fucking target! Oh, my. I'm having a lot of fun with this map. Really not having a lot of fun with this map at all. What's the fuck is to kill these steps? Seriously. I gave oh I didn't grab the super shock I probably wasn't a wise idea to ignore in the first place. Oh wow, this is not fun at all, is it? Keep getting killed by random shitty things. Constantly. No, thank you, Barrel. No, I need the SSG. Yeah, I don't like fucking that... the Ninja Gaiden. Actually, I've never really played the Ninja Gaiden game, but that game's about trying to play stuff a thousand times until you beat it. Really? No luck whatsoever there? Not a single fucking scratch? This isn't kind of one of those games where you have to play the game 60,000 times to be able to enjoy it for 10 minutes. Well, fuck it then. I'm just not going to get the enjoyment, so I'm just going to leave it. Stay up there and do whatever. No, I do not want to be hit by a red rocket from 10 miles away. Thank you. I'm all sick of getting hit by projectiles from 60 locations on the map. 
I like to at least know where it's coming from. God damn it. Right. Let's start seeing an end to all of this. Everything is happening at the same time. Shit. Yeah. Piss off. Also, you. Piss off. Am I safe here? Probably. take 50 fucking damage just killing one enemy. Jesus. Am I just not allowed to kill something in this map without there being something right there next to me? To just suddenly do like 40 damage with my rear guard or some shit? I hate these kind of fucking maps. And that's where it's just all aggro. But it's not like slaughter aggro, no, it's just little enemies in ones or twos that don't stop showing up all the time. Everywhere you go, there's another enemy waiting to meet you and greet you. Yes, stab him. Make him pay. I'll teach you to bequest stuff. What the f fucking shit? Okay, at least I know where the arch battle is. Wow, stairs. Let's make them all put together. Actually, that's probably a good thing. Please tell me it's the same vial. Good. Now he's gone. Now I don't have to deal with him. Anymore. Thank you. For once, I actually was able to duck into somewhere. Not get hit. By 60 things. There we go. Okay, good. So, yeah, as I was saying... No thanks. No thank you. You have enough of a presence in this shitty level. No way. Right. Serious Sam esque. Not quite serious Sam esque. Serious Sam esque would be picking up a health potion and being attacked by 10 enemies. And then having a fight that revolves around killing 300 at once. No, this is just a map where you go around every corner and there's an enemy waiting for you and if you try and kill that enemy, the enemies around you will kill you. So you either play the map enough times to speedrun it or you end up playing like this, which is really, really slowly and methodically clearing things out. So you end up with, well, this. Oh look, I was killed by a guy off to the right hand side. Better detonate those barrels. Might be easier if uh the really power actually was useful for once and actually had a pretend to bargain if I wasn't being attacked all the time. Oh look, we have what? Computery style lappy tops. Lappy tops. <sighs> Kinda glad the invisibility is just worn off though. I don't think we need it anymore. Or ever. Thank you. 
Yeah, once you know the map. Sounds like one of the worst traits. Once you know the map, access the strategy guide and buy the microtransactions. It's not that hard, really. You just gotta play for a million hours. Or an hour. It's the kind of thing that Ninja Gaiden is all about, all these really hard games. They just demand that you play them over and over again until you get really good at them or bored. Yes, I intentionally killed myself. I really, I really don't usually like these types of maps. Or games in general. It's like a different sort of thinking to Dark Souls, which is the opposite. Killing each other. worth it. I, uh, I had less health than I started. Yay. Oh, I gained 10% back. Okay, I gained 25% more. Keep an eye out for secrets. Ha 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 well, Dark Souls does do that, but the difference is that in Dark Souls, you don't usually get... The difference is that in Dark Souls, you usually... It's slower pace, tactical, and you usually know what killed you. Something like that. Like, there are some probable cheap deaths in Dark Souls, but usually... That is the exact sigil thing, you know? And what did I even unlock with that? That's the same sigil thing, shoot iron and a, a second sector was. Sigil! That did something. Oh, I'll tell you what it did. It cut me off from going back through the safety, so now I'm stuck here. Forced to take a lower path. Like, I've, beat, I've played and beaten Dark Souls 1. There is a great satisfaction to beating the bosses in that game, but the difference is, is that there's time to take it all in. You know, you can usually calculate where your mistake was and have a, a tend to go in. But most importantly, you don't die in two seconds flat, usually. You usually get a bit of a chance to do things the right way. You know, and over time you get better at it. Whereas I suppose in a game like Ninja Gaiden, it's all about constantly fooling the player and killing him rather quickly and sadistically. Or whatever. Okay. 
No thanks. Okay, that's potentially useful, but... I didn't need it for pistol zombies, no? Oh god, just die! Fucking arachnatrons. Hey. Alright, destroy all these barrels. Don't no, trust any of the barrels. Whatsoever. Not even that one. Zerk is also appreciated. Well, yeah, I've only played Dark Souls 1. I've not touched another Souls like since. I did. I would probably struggle with another Souls like, to be honest, but. It might be worth revisiting at some point. But we missed the stuff I want the secret. What? See, the secret, I had no option. I had to go down that way. Well, whatever. I got a god spear. No, a proper souls like is 3D, for one thing. Oh, okay. Oh, real neato. Lose a quarter of my benefit already. Hooray. Mega armor is better than nothing. Okay, fine. I haven't played a Souls White since Blasphemous. And honestly, in hindsight, I don't consider Blasphemous to be that difficult. But it was great fun. I mean, it threw me a couple of times, but I didn't spare... I, it did get easier. You definitely should. Blasphemous is fun. It's not the most difficult ish but it's got a great art style and it's just fun to play i love it when i just approach five feet on the map and it's like boy i can't wait to not be able to advance so quickly Killing one enemy is a fucking accomplishment. It means I don't have to deal with another sniper. Shoo, shoo! Thanks, prop. Block more rockets. Why don't you? Thanks, lost soul. Get in the way some more, why don't you? Eat more SSG shells, why don't you? Generally, don't die, why don't you? Is this boom combat I'm playing with? Ugh. Looks like I'm not getting the... The... No! I don't know, I just don't really have a lot of patience for difficult games in general. But... So 
When you invent, we request wood stain rotten in the future. Should you package the crossover as an extra request? I don't know. Right, let's see. Let's take out this sniping rev. Start to very slowly gain some map control. I mean, I'm the kind of person when I was younger that used to use a game G to cheat at NES games sometimes. I was, I've was i never really been one to sort of play games for difficulty's sake. Not that kind of person. I play games more for, I guess... Uh, just fun, I suppose? Immersion? Simplicity? I don't fucking know. But I'm not one of these that seeks out challenges, let's put it that way. Please, just for once, kill an enemy, not walk into a projectile. Just kill an enemy, and I just move on in my day. I'm a little tired of that now. Please, just don't. Don't! I said no fucking thank you. God. Hey, nice person in Twitch. How are you doing, by the way? Don't think I acknowledged you earlier. It's nice to see that there are nice people in Twitch. Oh, I fucking hate this staircase. It's so many staircases, it's just real awkward to get around. Like, not the kind where you can easily just run up, no. You gotta go past these guys to get up to this bit. This is just sort of a bloody nuisance, to be honest. There we go. Yes, like you. No, not you at all. Playing pistol starts on the controller. Yeah, that's why. I, that's why I probably have never handled PDP all that well. I I hate to do these kind of challenges, but when I do, I get immersed, and then uh, look, I just have a very poor mentality for that kind of thing. All right, just in general, it's a real shame because. It's you know. I, will call, I always will forever work on with envy for those players who play competitive games and don't care about dying a lot. Or are more chilled out and stuff, you know. You can ride the toughest challenges and Just, you know, 
Ah, oh, you gotta be fucking kidding me. Hang on. Is there something here I can do? Oh, there is! There's a giant puddle of... A thousand enemies waiting to kill me upon even going to a new area in the map! Here's an idea what we should do. No way, I couldn't think of anything witty. Once. Oh, wait, an earlier chain gun. That would have been handy. Yay, exploration. Why bother? There's just a, another pack of hungry, hungry enemies waiting to piss you off. All the day. That bad bag would be nice, though. Well, it's just to come up and get sniped by a, an enemy. No, might be okay, but I need to find the exact. Ah. Ah. There we go. The tables might be turning slightly. Hungry, hungry, lost souls. No! Oh, thank God. For once, I didn't have to deal with another, another fucking... Oh, hey, a red door. What's in here? Oh, I have preserved, don't I? Time to lose more health again. Thanks. Die, 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 fucking asshole. Oh god, why are there more things appearing? Stay down the cover. No! Wait. What the fuck? Oh yeah, of course. Ugh. Two vials. I can deal with two vials. If they're not accompanied by other things. No! No! Summoning vials. Fine. Everything is fine. All good. The story of this area is that it's an unpleasant area. Yeah, that's it. story then, Monsoon.
Hey, Nandy. Oh, he's not doing everything. Look at him go. That pain element always is going to town on him. He's still alive somehow. Still alive. Somehow. I don't think we're gonna have time for any other play test wads tonight. Which is fine. This is this is the only one I need to get done anyway. So no big deal. Ah, great. No, you... The Cyber Demon is killing everything for me. It's being really useful. Very so. So. Oh, they cornered him, I think. I think they've cornered him. They've got him cornered. Oh no, they don't. But they certainly. Oh, they did. They cornered his ass. Nice. Now I need the vial to disappear. Yeah, it's all right. Don't get the lucky SSG again. Wait. Well, that was handy. Thank you. Cybers. Me. Uh, right. Thank you, uh, Barons, for dealing with that cyber demon for me. And thus saving me a lot of ammo and frustration. Finally, something big kind of worked out for me. And I didn't even have to bust out the... Okay, so... Now what? With all these chairs and... Lava pit of you were really proud of this room. Oh, there's a BFG up there. Hanging in the rafters of this dining area. Oh lovely. We now have 666 enemies on this level total. I gotta get to another map after this one. Let's just move on. I think that time. BFG would be handy, but nah. I'm going to continue. Gonna continue onwards. Oh yes. 
Can't stay to appreciate the scenery. It's back to the grind of getting attacked from all angles, for daring to step into one alcove in a room because one enemy happens to get a shot off from wherever the fuck it is. Every 80 bazillion time. This day. Oh goody, and I've lost more damage to a far off thing. And there's a chain gunner. Now he's dead. Oh no, I'm going to go in the teleporter. Oh, hi Rev. Hi Rev. Hi Rev. Thanks for doing that or whatever that was. I'd like to go down there, but there's a million cacos. Very hungry. Ugh. Sorry, All right, why is it I'm after anyway? A blue key or something? Oh god, that might have been a mistake. Whoa, better wait a moment and see if there's any long range. No, nope, I guess we're okay for the moment. Fall down on here and definitely want to kill you. Oh god, no, just die! Sake. Can we not deal with a fucking revenant from a mile off every time? It's so infuriating. Here he is. Queer off. Thank you. Now I feel a little more safer. Now I don't feel any more safer. I don't even think there's any point to doing this. I just wasted all my armor for what game? Okay, so if I find the blue key, I'm just going to leave this map. He thinks. Problem is, I don't know where the blue key is. So, I'll probably, knowing my look with this map, I'll probably kill everything else and then find it, and then we'll be over. It is. Oh boy. Make sure I'm not gonna get barraged to death. I don't even know where to begin looking for this fabled, mythical, legendary, knowledgeable blue key. Oh, no. Oh, never mind. That's if I can find it. I see if... I, I didn't even spot it on a wedge or something, so... I don't even know where to go, to be honest with you. Ah. I'm almost down here. Oh, a secret chainsaw. Okay, cool, I guess. 
Hey, D. Craven, thanks for the 100 bits. Much appreciated. One west of those. One west of you. Now you're gone. Good. Don't need you either. I've been that way. Oh, fuck off, Weaky Rad Suits. Been for enough already. No, thank you. Will pass. Guess while I'm here, I should probably take advantage of this Rad Suit as much as possible. Okay, that's enough taking advantage of the Rad Suits. Ran out already. Back to the... Um... Okay. Sure. Shortcut passageway at last. Which doesn't lead anywhere. Weegee suit is really bad, we couldn't find a way to fix that. Well, the, the easy solution is not to use pain sectors. The hard solution probably requires coding. Okay, SSG, please! Oh, I wasn't actually fully blocked in, but I got it anyway. <laughs> there isn't really a way to fix that, unfortunately, Monsoon. If you have a lot of sectors with pain sectors, you're gonna get the weak your ad suit. Just be grateful it only happens 1% of the time, or whatever. Or whatever it is. Uh, UV maxing this map? You would have to play it a lot. I used to play it fast. Any oh, that's cool. So there was a way through to the, the numbing. There was a way through the numbing pus. Yep. 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 Just a ordinary casual 39 minutes in in-game time, but it feels like this map's been going on for an hour plus at this point. Uh yeah, okay, I'm glad that was a lift. I don't have my plasma yet, which is a bummer, but we'll deal with it. Oh, I see. The, the, I get, ah, God, I'm not allowed to just go onto that? Alright, then, whatever, pal. No! Why? Did you be. That's really awkward. Nice. And I missed.
away. I see a blue skull. I don't want to imagine. I'll set closed again. The hell on it. Nah, the BFG would just make this shorter. The fact I can just do this means this mastermind is, uh... No, you put one thing in, and that's this thing. I have an SSG in cover. This mastermind fight is trivial. Bye. Oh no, mastermind. Oh no, cover, and an SSG. Bye, mastermind. Thanks for playing. Please pick up your participation trophy from the whoever offers those and respawn hell. Most people seem to struggle. Struggle with the spider. Well, it's not like you really have many options in this fight. You have a small room where it's guarding the other end. You have to keep peeking out of cover. Really not much more to it in that particular spot. Masterminds are a very hard enemy to utilize correctly. So, you know. Don't worry, many other mappers also can't place Mastermind for the damn evil. Get out of that room or my bitrate will die. Look at the eyes, they're watching me in the chat. Ooh, look at him, he's going to scream again. Yeah, I guess that's also an option. Hey, 3D. Awesome. Alright, the blue key. I can leave this level. At last. My torment is almost over. I think. Really like the little subtly 3D and a plasma gun. Sweet. We can get out of here now. As I said, we can get out of here now. I should probably just do that. So let's do that. I choose the path of not playing this level any further. Suddenly the exit used to a new hidden place guided by arch vows of evidence. There's still plenty of monsters that can do that.
such a delightful waste of a 100% power up, but we beat that fight, I suppose. Oh, it's over! Ugh. Psych, I lied. There is a Revy spam. Oh, one third of the monsters are actually in a secret. Monsters, monsters, monsters. Yes, the Obake ward. I did it. This is your meanest creation yet, and you're not sorry. Forty six minutes in game time. Well, I have some good news for you. You're going back. Hi. Move on to map five. Please don't sue me, sweet pie. <laughs> Your 100 bits may pacify me for the moment. So, thanks for that. My, 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 uh, my emotions can be bought for a dollar, it seems. I'll buy that for a dollar. Ugh. I don't think I need to add anything extra to that map. That map was pain. Constant pain. Pain and punishment. Bob Prime. Oh no, we are cursed for more demos for the archive. After Braving through a great battle within a corrupted earthly war zone consumed by the greed and glutton of the demons. And finally found the gateway to Bob. A truly evil place where the sulfuric air a world threatens to poison the entire cosmos. And the royal demon spirits of the everlasting Dark Lord await your rage in the unholy garrison of this blasphemous Terradome. You know the fight will be suicide, you know you'll likely never make it out alive, but you know you can put an end to Bob, and you can put an end to this madness once and for all. You pump your shotgun as you charge towards the demons and they stay the same to you. It's time to put Bob down for good. Yes, you made something that was memorable for tonight, Infernal Monsoon. Memorably painful. Your ticket to the Slaughter Fest gun show will be in the post. You may even get your own Alfredo, Time, or Joshi. Who knows? Anyway. Sorry. Welcome to Bob Prime, the center of this alternate universe. The fate of the world depends on you. Go forth and defeat Bob once and all. Pain is just another word for love. Oh, right, we're pistol starting, aren't we? Fuck. Run away! I'd rather go to Dennis. Wake everything up. Interrupted! Bow, 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 
Sorry, not a fan of games. How is this music? What? Which? Which bullet hell shooter is this? Somewhere between Craven. Bars are down again. Oh, those bars. to that for a moment. A door opens back in the large hall. We Ah. Dang it. Yes, that's what happens when you fall into a... Th this guy. No, we need something to occupy. We, uh, I'm waving. Uh, whoa! What the? Ow! Uh. Uh. 
fine. Whatever. Forming an FPS, mix of a timing puzzle. Who designed this level? Jim Wally Podge. Yeah, you tell that Jim Wally Podge. Fucking timing FPS platforming with timing. Oh. around then I guess we serious business Second, we gotta make sure everything is nice and clear. Okay. And it's nose. 
John, mouse aim is on. Oh, thank God. It was all over. Yeah, sorry, my traumatic experiences of every icon of sin ever came back to haunt me there. I seem to completely forget that I had a uh, mouse aim on. Thanks to 25. Misfit. Right, well, Bob's dead. Yay! All three members of this WADS team have now given me cash in the form of in the form of Twitch bits. Two dollars and fifty cents I have made off the team from this game. This this ward. A winner is you. Yeah. Entering credits, I guess. After pumping rocket after rocket into Bob's exposed brain, a screen wide enough to pierce through the very fabric of reality spans for light years across this nightmare dimension. Bob is defeated! His dynamic army cry out for their great leader as his death brings them great suffering, weighing down all arms to mourn the loss of the world. You watch the pathetic horde, feeling nothing but seething hatred towards them. Suddenly a portal opens up behind you, the same red and blue one from before as the grey man steps out of it, clapping his hands giving you a few bravos for your amazing performance. Well you did it my man, if anyone could defeat the great Bob, of course it would be you. He laughs and claps more as he smiles at the demons groveling at the sight of you. But you know I can't let you leave this place, don't you? He said with a straight and serious face as if it was his purpose in life. He put your shotgun to his head, forcing him to open the portal back home, but he just shakes his head at you remorsefully. You see what you just killed was not THE Bob, but rather an incarnation of Bob himself, and you release Bob's spirit from this now husk of a vessel. You see, you were faster, you were stronger. You. He likes you better. You look at him in confusion because you just snuffed out this great evil and now you just want to go home and relax. Oh, so you thought that's how this would play out. Quite like. Hey, why am I scum? <laughs> oh yes, very Dusk reference. Do you f- Oh, there's more text, sorry. Do you feel that tickle at the back of your throat? The slightly heightened pitch in your voice? Ah, don't give me that look. Of course you do. It's too late for you now. You see, he's taking over you already. All that's left for him is to get in that head of yours and he'll be a beat born. You are the new Bob now. You listen to his words with rushed and heavy breaths. The thought of becoming the very thing you set out to destroy as you fear for the safety of humanity is too much to bear. You rip. Grip your chest as it violently tightens, the world around you growing ever darker by the second. And thanks to you, Bob has lost his power and now I can once again seal him away where he can do no harm. At least until he, you, grows astronomically more powerful yet again one day and a new Bob must be chosen. I am sorry but this is the only way and thus I bid you farewell. He walks away from you as you reach out to him in pain. I have to meet up with an old friend. He's quite good with computer viruses. Maybe that's what you'll need to put you in your place, Bob. He walks through the portal and closes it behind him, leaving you stranded in this ruined abyss. Three large demons comfort you as the world grows dark and in this hell you know these are your friends, your mates. They ask how you are and what you need, but simply reply, Well, I'm quite hungry. I like Dusk too. Dusk is good. Reboot. You are now the demons. No, I don't want to be the demons. I don't want to be the demons at all. It's not fair. You know what, I'm not going to need to do another thing for this one because this is the only thing that got played tonight. And the only thing that will be played tonight, I think. So... There, yeah, that was a piece of shit. 
No, I'm just kidding. A piece of hell. The community project. Uh, what did we all think of that? John was a Bob. I am not Bob. I am a free John. I loved it. That's great. It's almost like you took part in it. And therefore, I have a particularly interestingly biased opinion. I want to hear from people who didn't make maps in this board. <laughs> you have become Roberto. Granted, it was over a year ago, so our design philosophies have changed since then. But hey, I'm proud of it. A year ago. Really changed in a year? Damn. Speak for yourself. Dopefish is still God. Well, yeah, he still streams on Dopewiz. Of course he does. Uh, considering I did overwriting, which I did in the first draft of most of the maps, so I really put a lot of heart and soul into it. Yeah, I can kind of tell. Stupid fish. Uh, so, my thoughts really are that this is obviously um, a community project made with some consideration between a couple of friends um, with some light-hearted, goofy elements to it. I think the best map in terms of uh, the world was probably the third one. Although, um, yeah, personal project. I think that's a good way of summarizing it. Um, it was all right. It was fine, but screw that map four. That was just evil. Like, I would... like to appreciate the evilness, but I cannot, so... What about your map? Oh yeah, your map was fine, it was a... An, uh, at least it was an icon of sim map where I could use mouse look, so that's a positive. You know, you had a nice, simple... Icon of sim finale, which was fine. Okay. Uh... But yeah, fun... Uh, stuff um, overall um, that's about all I have to offer I don't think there's much else to play test all I could say is that this is uh, if you've changed your stuff since then I can I can see um, I I don't know if you'd want to make another map as evil as map 4 again, or not. But... Uh, it's certainly interesting from a non-linear perspective as well. I mean, as evil as it was, I think you certainly put the most effort into the fourth map. And perhaps it shows as being the standout map. A bleak in my particular case for all the reasons that being absolutely fucking evil. So, I. I'm sure others would really appreciate that kind of map, though. And if you find those people and they play it, then you will get more praise. You prefer exploring for more unorthodox ideas like the gentle dark one more. Uh, yeah, I'm really joining. I'm getting very tired. Poor John should go to bed early tonight and sleep. I always struggle on a Tuesday morning to get up and be alert for work, so it might not be the worst idea in the world to go to bed a bit earlier for once and actually stick to that. Um, but overall, this was a fun little project. i certainly glad I play-tested it and played it, and I hope that you all enjoyed watching it. Um, yeah, cool. Thanks for recommending it to me. Right, and with that, 
Um, the uh, stream is going to be over for tonight. So, ooh, wow, 32 viewers, awesome. Thanks for all, you all for sticking around. Uh, the 32 have stuck around to this point. Um, so, uh, I'm afraid I have to deliver the bad news for the Doom fans in the... Oh, 33, cool. I was afraid to do some bad news for the Doom uh, fans. This is, unfortunately, for the time being, uh, the end of the Doom stuff for a little bit. But not for too much longer. Uh, we've had a lot of Doom in the last week with 3x3 free free playtesting and um, Heartland, of course, the new skill sword. So I've given you plenty of Doom over the last week. Um, but now it's back to the other game list. So starting from tomorrow, I will be playing uh, Sudake, uh, which was gifted to me by an anonymous gifter who will be revealed tomorrow evening when I let you know who they are. Um, and we'll be playing Sudakai from the other game list. Uh, but don't worry, there will be some Doom later in the week. There is the ever so small matter of an Iron Man to do. Um, I don't know actually, it could be done next week, but it will be done at some point in the near future. Oh, you remember the initial Xbox you remember the Viking? I, I have no idea what kind of game it is, even, really. So I'm just going to go in blind and see what happens. Uh, but yeah, there is... Oh, oh, very tired, sorry. Um, there is the Iron Man and the Iron Eagle to be done later this week. If it's not done this week, it will have to be done in the next three days of next week. So I don't have a lot of time. I'm still waiting for A.N. Mutt to do his attempt, you see. It all comes down to Mutt's attempt timing. I can do it as soon as he has his run, so I have to wait and see how he does. Um, but if I manage to finish Sudokai quickly, I don't think it's a long game. Partly it takes between 11 to 20 hours. Uh, I will then be playing Redundancy, which is the final bequest on my list that has two, pe two people... I have requested it, so it will be the last thing uh, on the list that has multiple requesters. And after that, the list really opens up to a lot of options. So there will be some Doom to come. As I said, I'm alternating between other games and Doom stuff. That is the plan. So who shall we raid? Probably always too much momentum. And viewers, who shall we raid tonight? Let's see what's happening. I I, I do see a Jimmy. Just seeing if there's anyone else. Ooh, we have. Well, um, I would. I'm going to raid somebody a bit different tonight. We're going to raid I Punch Demons, who is playing some Doom, playing the modest mapping challenge. I think the first one, requested by Jark. So I will see you all tomorrow night for Sudokai, and if you're just here for the Doom stuff, I will see you later this week or the start of next for the Iron Man stuff. So thank you all for watching. Thanks to MFG, Inferno, and D Craven for making and being around for this playthrough, and uh, stay safe and have a good evening.